New this morning, we are learning that a former PhD student at the University of Washington is among the hundreds of people who have died in the Hamas attack on Israel. Fox News' Joe Mathiafil joins us now live in studio with more on how the young man's being remembered this morning. Joe. Shauna and Bonnie, a 32-year-old Chaim Katzman was killed in his apartment in Israel on Saturday. His uncle says that he died while helping his neighbor and another neighbor's children. He says Katzman was trying to hide with the woman when terrorists burst into his home. Found him in the closet, but apparently he was, I think he was lying on top of her, protecting her. They opened fire. He was killed. She survived. Katzman graduated with his doctorate from the University of Washington's Jackson School of International Studies in June of 2021. He dedicated his studies to understanding the interrelations of religion and politics, notably in Israel and Palestine. He wasn't just an academic, though. He was a DJ, a gardener, and a car mechanic. Rabbi Mendel Weingarten says Chaim was one of the first people to welcome him when he moved to Washington back in 2017. But he was always very warm, welcoming, and to the point. He would always check in, see how we're doing, but always with a smile. Didn't release a statement about the attack from Hamas. It reads in part, uh, this is a quote, of course. Uh, the terror, loss of life, and outbreak of war in Israel and Gaza over the weekend, which began with the reprehensible attack, attacks by Hamas, is devastating to all of us, and my heart is with every member of our community who has ties to or loved ones in this deeply troubled region. The tragic reality is that civilians have borne and will bear the brunt of this violence. A vigil to honor and remember Chaim Katzman. Katzman is planned for later tonight. And coming up in our next hour of Good Day Oregon, we are going to hear from the woman uh, that Katzman is being credited with saving. She did actually escape from Hamas. We'll hear her story directly from her coming up in our next hour. Sean.